processing here, milking. Welcome to Agricultural Machinery and Testing Station here in Beijing, China. Come on, subscribe. Standing in Chinese ground, taking Chinese yogurt, yogi yogi, as you can see, carrying a Chinese bag. What are you saying? Eh? In a Chinese farm. Amazing. Subscribe, subscribe. Subscribe. We are coming with more and more hot and crazy content. In this video, we would be talking about farming, you know, animal husbandry. So let's do this. Hey viewers all over the world. Uh, the other time I got a comment that someone was watching me from Canada. Thank you so much all of the viewers wherever you are watching this video from i would like to thank you so much for dedicating your time to following me on youtube so in this video we'll be talking about a farm or a test station in beijing china it goes by the name beijing agricultural machinery test station so this test station was established in 1958 it's an approach to transforming agriculture in china particularly towards modernizing farming practices the primary aim of the test station was to conduct research and development activities in agricultural machinery to enhance productivity efficiency sustainability and ensure agricultural machinery meet the desired standard the founders of this magnificent test station were a famous american couple who dedicated their efforts to transforming agriculture in china the husband was an expert in animal husbandry this amazing couple got married in 1949 and settled in china where they spent many decades as dairy farmers following the husband's death in 2003 their wife lived alone on the farm in beijing until her death on june 8 2010 so she died on 8 june 2010 both were buried at the farm this is amazing history during their time the couple worked hard for decades and made outstanding contributions to the development of agricultural mechanization and the improvement of dairy cattle breeds in china amongst others beijing agricultural machinery test station provides theoretical and technical training to students as well as farmers of which the training includes how to make dairy products measure animal feeds and more they also mentor children that for one really to achieve anything in life is through efforts and hard work hence deploying agricultural skills on them while they are young on the farm cows are busy grazing visitors can get close to the cows as much as they want they can feed the cows and take photos with them and may drink fresh milk so for me personally i got an opportunity to feed calves like i gave the calf water so that's an amazing achievement for me in 2023 in the land of china back to the farm calves are separated from their mothers for reasons of economic gain such to increase milk yield control calf feeding and for hygiene the farm makes incredibly 30 liters of milk per cow per day did you hear that the farm makes incredibly 30 liters of milk per cow per day that's amazing right so yeah i would like to to, to deliver this uh notification message to farmers and potential farmers that there is an amazing secret amazing secrets that i would like to share with you subscribe and you access this amazing secret by clicking on the description of the video you would find it there these are tips on what you can do to achieve maximum results when it comes to dairy farming so 
come with me into the video thank you so much for sticking around whoa 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 before you join me into this video ne i wanted to share with you the location like where to find this farm in china china is a big land it's a big place so this this farm is particularly located in beijing not in the cbd though but it's in shahe town if you are familiar with china so you would locate this farm from shahe town changping district of beijing do you have cattle farmings in in the cities like the chinese are having a, a an interesting farm in the city what about you drop a comment how do you do agriculture at your country how do you deal with animal husbandry drop a comment we also want to learn let's share and develop africa and other cities of the world the entire globe eh? let's do this let's do this let's do this come on so join me as i share these amazing visuals regarding my visit at beijing agricultural machinery test station thank you so much for sticking around once again once again and once again thank you so much You see this yogurt? It was produced here. As you can see, those cows, the milk, the milk that went into making this yogurt, it came right from those cows, as you can see. We are really encouraging agriculture, farming, animal husbandry. Please. Culture on the move, making strides in agricultural market. only know about uh, China's industrial area. This one is a farming area, farming area, farming area. China here. Yebo. How do you deal with animal husbandry in your country? Are you also doing it the same way like here at Beijing Agricultural Machinery Test Station? Are you doing it the same way or are you doing it differently? Drop a comment. Look at the small ones. Look at the small ones.
Can you hear the sound of kettles? Can you hear it? Amazing. Do you love agriculture? What is your what are your majors in school? Do you love agriculture or what 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 are your interests when it comes to education? Eh? I'm getting interested in agriculture. I mean I studied journalism, but I got also like a passion for agriculture. It's just a matter of time. Only time will tell. Maybe I would start up my farming activities one day, both crop production and animal husbandry. Animal husbandry here in Beijing. Animal husbandry process here in Beijing. Milking process in here, milking. You can see. Beijing Agriculture Machinery and Testing Station.